look around. Die! I think the Inquisition could benefit from this.
I want a constant watch on that damn thing. Sound the alarm at the first sign of demons. Turn back. We can't do anything. I think we could have skipped these things getting weirder, don't you? There are many mages in Redcliffe. Maybe Fiona will know what's going on. Make her have mercy. It's over. Open the gates. We spread word the Inquisition was coming. But you should know that no one here was expecting us. No one? Not even Grand Enchanter Fiona? If she was, she hasn't told anyone. We've arranged use of the tavern for the negotiations. Agents of the Inquisition, my apologies. Magister Alexius is in charge now, but hasn't yet arrived. He's expected shortly. You can speak with the former Grand Enchanter in the meantime. The veil is weaker here than in Haven. I have not really offered in a way I have not seen. Look at that old thing. I'm surprised it's still standing.
find you more to help? Join the Inquisition. Do you need it? I remember the first time the dead walked these lands, when a blood mage poisoned our leman. The ashes of Andrastia herself brought the Arl back from his enchanted slumber. Tell me about your people. They say a spirit dwells in a small lake south of the highway. The girls of the village bring it daisies and ask for love, but rarely does it listen. For it is a spirit of valor, not love, and it favors blood lotus flowers. took flowers to your wife's shrine for you. I... I do not know what to say, except thank you. I never expected anyone not of the blood to care. My Senna would be grateful. Her shrine lies on a hill to the west, near the table stones. Thank you. Stay safe. Walk in peace. So each ocularum is made from the skull of a tranquil. I had wondered what became of those poor souls when the circles collapsed. Now we know. I figured they'd fled with the rebel mages. Poor bastards. I had wondered what had become of them when the mages rebelled. What a tragic waste.
get over that sky. Ooh. Good day. people dying for want of simple herbs. My apologies. Can I help you? Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes. We've many injured from attacks by those cursed Templars. I need the herbs to treat people's wounds. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. Goodbye. Stay safe out there. May I help you? I found some of the herbs you were looking for. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. A pleasure to see you again. I found some of the herbs you were looking for. This is exactly what I needed. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. A pleasure to see you again. I found some of the herbs you were looking for. This is exactly what I needed. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. Let me try.
Please, are you with the Inquisition? As you've wandered, have you by any chance seen a rat that is, um, different? Lord Wolseley wandered off, and he's very special. If you could find him, I'd be most grateful. What makes your ram so special? Well, he's always brought the family luck, and his advice helped us make our fortune. Your ram offered advice? He's a very special ram. Your ram has gone missing. Yes. I'm certain that if he heard his Jimmy missed him, he'd come right back. He's likely at our family's old summer cabin. It's by the lake in the southern hills. If you do find him and send him back, I'd be happy to pay you. I'll speak with you later. If you find my ram, please send him home. They say Andraste sent you to save the world. If it'll help save lives and bring peace, I'll be the first to believe. Make a speed loop. I found the letter you sent a Templar named Corrib. What? Shit. You can't prove anything. A letter from a rogue Templar. Nobody is going to care. So, what do you intend to do? Well, what kind of cut are they giving you? Have you got protection? I see a suspicious lack of guards. It looks to me like you've been cut loose. Maybe you should look for a new employer. Are you serious? The high and mighty Inquisition needs smugglers. All right, I'm in. Seems like the Inquisition is the safer bet these days. Thank you. It's good to have commerce restored. I've many goods here if you can trade.
limousine, I presume? A uh, young man named Jimmy would very much like you to return home. Ah, good. as is possible. The Fade contains a wealth of knowledge for those who know where to look. Sure, but I don't know how you dream, let alone wander around in there. Especially when the shit that comes out of the Fade generally seems pretty cranky. So are humans, but we continue to interact with them when we must. Greetings, Traveller. Good day. I do not suppose you've found my Senna's shrine. I know it is a long way to go. I clean Senna's shrine and place the flowers. May her ashes be gathered by Falondeen and carried safely. After all the long years she carried me. Thank you. You do a foolish old man too much kindness. Thank you, friend. May your Inquisition do as much good for the land as you have done for me.
Welcome, agents of the Inquisition. What has brought you to Redcliffe? We're here because of your invitation back in Val Royaux. You must be mistaken. I haven't been to Val Royaux since before the Conclave. If it wasn't you who invited me here, who was it? I... I don't know. Now that you say it, I feel strange. Whoever or whatever brought you here, the situation has changed. The Free Mages have already pledged themselves to the service of the Tevinta Imperium. Andras Tezas. I'm trying to think of a single worse thing you could have done, and I've got nothing. I understand that you are afraid, but you deserve better than slavery to Tevinta. As one indenture to a Magister, I no longer have the authority to negotiate with you. Very well. Who's in charge now? Welcome, my friends. I apologize for not greeting you earlier. Agents of the Inquisition, allow me to introduce Magister Girion Alexius. The Southern Mages are under my command. And you are the survivor, yes? The one from the Fade? Interesting. I'd like to know more about this alliance between the Rebel Mages and the Imperium. Certainly. What specifically do you wish to know? What does the Imperium gain from taking Rebel Mages under its wing? For the moment, the Southern Mages are a considerable expense. After they are properly trained, they will join our Legion. You said not all my people would be military. There are children, those not suited. And one day I'm sure they will all be productive citizens of the Imperium when their debts are paid. The Grand Enchanter told me she was indentured to a Magister. Our Southern Brethren have no legal status in the Imperium. As they were not born citizens of Tevinta, they must work for a period of ten years before gaining full rights. As their protector, I shall oversee their work for the Imperium. I'm not clear on when exactly you negotiated this arrangement with Fiona. When the Conclave was destroyed, these poor souls faced the brutality of the Templars who rushed to attack them. It could only be through divine providence that I arrived when I did. It was certainly very timely. I haven't seen any sign of Redcliffe's Arl or his men. The Arl of Redcliffe left the village. Left? An Arl would never voluntarily leave his seat. There were tensions growing. I did not want an incident. If you're leading the mages now, then let's talk. I'm sure we can come to an arrangement. It is always a pleasure to meet a reasonable man. Felix, would you send for a scribe, please? Pardon my manners. My son Felix, friends. I am not surprised you're here. Containing the breach is not a feat that many could even attempt. There is no telling how many mages would be needed for such an endeavor. Ambitious indeed. Does that mean you'll lend your mages to our cause? There will have to be. Felix. My lord, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Are you all right? I'm fine, father. Come, I'll get your powders. Please excuse me, friends. We will have to continue this another time. Fiona, I require your assistance back at the castle. I don't mean to trouble everyone. I shall send word to the Inquisition. We will conclude this business at a later date.
come to the Chantry, you are in danger. Ooh, very mysterious. We'll be careful, but we need to figure out what's going on here. We don't need your kind here. Your Inquisition's just Templars by another name. Who are you? Linnea. Just Linnea. Don't ask what Circle Tower I'm from, because we're done with that. We're all free mages now. You'd rather bow to Devinter than join the Inquisition? All you Chantry types think the same way. The Imperium is a great evil that must be avoided. It's just because they're ruled by mages. No one wants us to look at them and say their mages are free and the world hasn't ended. But don't magisters summon demons and practice human sacrifice? The Chantry says whatever they think will scare us. What's wrong with blood magic? People don't like the idea of us controlling their thoughts, but they have no problem with us throwing fireballs in their walls. In Tevinter, the mages police themselves. It works. I'm here because I believe mages deserve their freedom. Right. And I'm the Empress of Orlais. Magister Alexius does not approve of those without magic like you and me. You may not wish to stay long. Many villagers have already left to escape his ire. What does the Magister have against you? He does not like to be reminded of what mages can become. He says all Tranquil must leave Redcliffe, but who would take us in? What are Tranquil? Those like me, without the strength of will necessary to protect ourselves from demons. Rather than risk me becoming possessed, the Circle removed my connection to the Fade. My magic is gone, along with my dreams and desires. Those now in Redcliffe prefer not to see us. How long have De Vinters been here? Magister Alexius arrived at nightfall, two days after we retreated from the Temple of Sacred Ashes. He forced anyone without magic out of the castle, save those he required to serve him. Even the Arl was sent away. Farewell, then. One moment. You are a member of the Inquisition, are you not? I am an alchemist. You must require potions. If the Magister will not have me here, Perhaps I can offer my services. We would be delighted to have you working for the Inquisition. Thank you. While one lives, it is good to believe there is still a use for one's talents. Circle of Magi in Hospital. Lived my whole life there. Since I was ten years old and came into my magic. Three meals a day. Quality education. A roof over my head. If you're not summoning demons, a mage tower is a fine place to be. If you were happy in the circle, why are you here with the rebels? We're all rebels, man. 
the vote saw to that. The majority wanted to dissolve the circles. The rest of us went with them and were cut loose. I figured I'm better off with my fellow mages than on my own. You're not happy with this new alliance? Something's not right about that lot. They're not like us. Magic or no, I'd rather count myself among decent folk than stand with Magisters. How did the Grand Enchanter end up working with Tevinter? One minute, we were bracing for the Templars to attack. The next, we had a Magister ally. It was a stroke of luck that's given us an edge. In a way. Out of the frying pan. Goodbye. Be careful. The Tevinters likely aren't happy you're asking questions.
Good. You're finally here. Now help me close this, would you? that work exactly <laughs> you don't even know do you you just wiggle your fingers and boom rift closes who are you ah getting ahead of myself again I see Dorian of house Parvis most recently of Minrathus how do you do magister Alexius was once my mentor so my assistance should be valuable as I'm sure you can imagine I was expecting Felix to be here. I'm sure he's on his way. He was to give you the note, then meet us here after ditching his father. Alexius couldn't jump to Felix's side fast enough when he pretended to be faint. Is something wrong with him? He's had some lingering illness for months. Felix is an only child, and Alexius is being a mother hen, most likely. Are you a magister? All right. Let's say this once. I'm a mage from Tevinter, but not a member of the Magisterium. I know Southerners use the terms interchangeably, but that only makes you sound like barbarians. You're betraying your mentor because... Alexius was my mentor. Meaning he's not any longer, not for some time. Look, you must know there's danger. That should be obvious even without the note. Let's start with Alexius claiming the allegiance of the mage rebels out from under you. As if by magic, yes? Which is exactly right. To reach Redcliffe, before the Inquisition, Alexius distorted time itself. I hope that's less dangerous than it sounds. More. That is fascinating, if true, and almost certainly dangerous. The rift you closed here. You saw how it twisted time around itself? Sped some things up and slowed others down. Soon, there will be more like it. And they'll appear further and further away from Redcliffe. The magic Alexius is using is wildly unstable. And it's unraveling the world. You're asking me to take a lot on faith. I know what I'm talking about. I helped develop this magic. When I was still his apprentice, it was pure theory. Alexius could never get it to work. What I don't understand is why he's doing it. Ripping time to shreds just to gain a few hundred lackeys? He didn't do it for them. Took you long enough. Is he getting suspicious? No, but I shouldn't have played the illness card. I thought he'd be fussing over me all day. My father's joined a cult, the Vinter Supremacists. They call themselves Venatori. And I can tell you one thing. Whatever he's done for them, he's done it to get to you. Alexius is your father. Why are you working against him? For the same reason Dorian works against him. I love my father, and I love my country. But this? Cults? Time magic? What he's doing now is madness. For his own sake, you have to stop him. It would also be nice if he didn't rip a hole in time. There's already a hole in the sky. Why would he rearrange time and indenture the Mage Rebellion just to get to me? They're obsessed with you, but I don't know why. Perhaps because you survived the Temple of Sacred Ashes. You can close the rifts. Uh, maybe there's a connection. Or they see you as a threat. If the Venatori are behind those rifts or the breach in the sky, they're even worse than I thought. Do you have any suggestions? You know you're his target. 
Expecting the trap is the first step in turning it to your advantage. I can't stay in Redcliffe. Alexius doesn't know I'm here, and I want to keep it that way for now. But whenever you're ready to deal with him, I want to be there. I'll be in touch. Oh, and Felix, try not to get yourself killed. There are worse things than dying, Dorian. <laughs>